Uh, what we have is a F-35 cockpit demonstrator. This is an exact replica of the F-35 cockpit. It is a single-seated aircraft. It means one woman or man flies the airplane. Um, in fact, this is an actual cockpit. And when I say actual cockpit, this is an actual ejection seat. It came out of one of our very first test aircraft. Um, and we've since removed the rocket motors, so it is safe. But everything you see inside of the cockpit, including the, uh, the throttle, the side stick control, and the screens up front are actual functioning just like they would in the aircraft itself. My goal is very simple. I don't want a fair fight. When we deploy our military, I want it to be overwhelming. I want it to be decisive and end as soon as possible. I don't want anybody on the other side having the capability we do and to keep distance from the enemy means you have to innovate. So the Lockheed Martin family needs to be very proud of what you produce for the country. Technology this sophisticated is not easy to develop. As something new is something transformational, and you expect starts and stops. Very similar to our iPad, it's really modifiable based on your desired wishes as an operation. What sets it apart from everything else? I flew F-18s in the Navy, and uh, the step above in technology are the stealth principles that have been designed from the onset of this aircraft. Sensor fusion or data fusion, the ability for the aircraft to blend multiple sources of information into a single display that provides a very efficient and user-friendly conduit for me to operate. And lastly is our helmet-mounted display system. This uh, visor and helmet setup that, we, that the pilots are going to wear projects all the information they need on the visor and it is pilot-selectable for multiple source input to the visor. Thank <laughs> you.